Alrighty folks, hello and welcome back to Age of Empires, the Definitive Edition. I'm Don Hayes and this is Campaign 6, Ave Caesar. Gaius Julius Caesar carried the highest virtues of the Roman Republic, but his ambitions would cause the Republic's downfall. Marked with this storied son of Rome from his captivity by the Cilician pirates to his expedition to the ends of the earth, and from his conquest of Gaul to his crushing victory over his rivals. Discover why Roman emperors would proudly bear his name for centuries. Ave Caesar. Oh, the rumors when the rich families in Rome heard that the young Caesar of the Julii family had been captured by Cilician pirates. Thank the gods that you are free now. I had hoped to dissuade you from raising a fleet and attacking the pirates to exact your vengeance instead of returning to Rome and your family. But I see you have made up your mind, and, knowing your late father, I recognize this stubbornness runs in the family. So, set sail, young Caesar, and redeem your family name once and for all. Alrighty, so this is a pretty straightforward mission. Destroy all enemy docks and do not lose Caesar. Let's begin. All right, so we are going to ignore everything to start with. We're just going to use Caesar to grab the town so we can start building up our eco. And then we'll, uh, we'll send Caesar to deal with this lot in due course. So I definitely want to build at least one farm, build a couple of fishing boats. Deal with Caesar and deal with all these uh, doodads over here. Caesar's an absolute goat, so he's not going to die anytime soon. We do want to upgrade to Trium as soon as we can. We also want to be careful about running out of food, so do uh, skyrocket our eco first. I'm going to send this guy over here so we can start building some second TC. So start this. Don't really need stone this mission. I think we've killed all the bobbins. So we do need to repel a couple of uh, enemy attacks. They are pretty relentless in the early game. They do they do fall off quite early. Gold is something we will need, but honestly, we don't need a huge amount of it. We only need enough just to create um, a couple of. Uh, Catapult triems, but this is an entirely um, naval-focused mission. The only other thing we actually want is a marketplace. Brown is the biggest challenge in terms of um, ships. Um, however, yellow actually is the one that drops us from a uh, landing party perspective. I mean, a couple of extra sentry towers is actually a good thing. We will be getting a second dock as soon as we're able. I'm not expecting the fishing boats to survive much longer into this game. At 
this point it's all about just wood production. It's pretty much the only resource we need right now. We will get onto gold in due course. landing. Beautiful. To be fair, um, Caesar can deal with that even if they did land, but it's just nice not to have to deal with it. At all. So Red really is a very weak faction. They just send like scouting ships. They're the ones that probably attack us the most throughout this mission, but they're also the, like the weakest faction. Um, I tend to ignore them until we, we take out yellow first, which is down here. Then we take out brown, which is down here. And then we're left with the weak threat that is red. Um, we do want to hit our age up. Oh, well, not age up, sorry. We want to hit our cat box triums as soon as possible. So we're just going to focus a bit more heavily on food at this point. Let's go over here. To repair than to uh, completely rebuild new. So these guys will split off, of course, they have. Let's put them on gold. I'm going to grab these two upgrades. any more villagers at this point. Do you wanna... Do you kind of want that upgrade, but I also uh, would rather get the catapult tree and upgrade started ASAP Rocky. We do also need to build a granary actually. Just that we can uh, refresh the farms. So we've got our uh, bulk of our forces ready to rock and roll. Need a couple of catapult triums and then we're uh, ready to uh, start ending this mission. So we can move over to and transition to this um, area for Wood Eco. Um, we are going to need to do that pretty quickly actually. We are very rapidly running out of trees on this side. We do also want to grab this upgrade as well. So we've got three catapult triums. That should be enough to start. We are going to want more but for now, three is more than enough to start the uh, the enemy at the assault. The yellow is going to be our main target because they are the ones that tend to drop us and they're the ones that give us the highest chance of losing since Caesar can die. And that is a lose condition. That's 
two team number four. Not really. This is the only other thing that's possibly worth grabbing. Don't have. You don't need to have any need for a land army. This mission, it's all sea, but sea based. I mean, this is uh, writing is already on the wall at this point. Um, there's not really anything we need to be super careful of. The enemies kind of just run out of steam very quickly in this mission. I'm not even sure why, but the attacks kind of dissipate. And even if they were to continue attacking, there's not really a huge amount they can actually do. You know, we have a massive fleet at this point. Scouting boats really are laughable versus uh, Iron Age ships. This is why we won't take out yellow. Like they're just relentless um, drops. If we weren't there to deal with it, it would be annoying and enough to potentially end the mission in a bad way. You have to start building priests and things to probably heal up Caesar. I'm actually going to put him on a control group just so I can keep a, an eye on him. Honestly, once we take out yellow, there really is no threat left on the map. Especially with the sentry towers we've got. I mean, they'll buy so much time. It's uh, kind of funny. There's one. There's two. Move on at this point. Yeah, I would say going for um, brown at this point is the better option. Honestly, red is just so weak. There really is no threat from them. Brown is still the one with like an Iron Age fleet. But we might as well, as soon as we've got enough food, we might as well grab the upgrade. Whilst I wouldn't normally go for the upgrade, I think it's it's basically one range and a bit of extra health. And it's not like we need any more ships at this point, so the extra uh, range is actually pretty decent. Although completely unnecessary. I've got nothing else to spend my food on. It's not like we'll be building any land uh, units this mission anyway.
So I am very much looking forward to the new announcement of the new um, Age of Empires 2 Chronicles series. I believe it is an expansion, but it looks pretty cool. Glad we're getting some more Age of content. I mean, um, us Age of uh, fanboys have been getting a lot of Age of content recently, so this is uh, this is great. More Age of content? Yes, please and thank you. Dun 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 Bum 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 Dun 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 Ba ba da ba da ba da 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 So we are going to want to move out this direction That is closer to red So we just need to take care of these towers I'm going to create a second fleet so that I can deal with Red super quick. Dun 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 Right, so the big threat for Red, and, well I say threat, it's not a threat, it's um... The biggest challenge is this area here. Because it is very well protected. All the other docks are literally just pushovers to grab. So I was creating a new fleet for that one and using our existing fleet for this particular dock. I mean, Slingers versus Triams is still laughable, let's be honest. Stairs dock. One. Two should be over here. The other option is you can get them to resign, but it's unlikely they will. There's another door. And the last one, I believe, it is somewhere around here. So run up and find it. I can't remember if it's up here or down there. Dun 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 dun. There is the last one. I generally can't remember. Oh, there. I remember. It's over here. I 
And that, my friends, is all she wrote for this mission. A nice straightforward opener for uh, for this campaign. GG's. The expedition against your kidnappers has boosted your reputation among the Roman elite and has shown you to be a man of your word. People will think twice before taking action against you, and several senators have asked for your friendship. Two mighty men, Pompey and Crassus, have even asked you to join them in a triumvirate and rule over Rome together. Soon you will be one of the most important men in the whole Republic. Alrighty folks, well that'll about it for this first mission. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, please do give it a thumbs up if this is the kind of content you enjoy. Then please do consider subscribing to the channel. It does help support the channel and would be greatly appreciated. Do let me know your thoughts in the comments section below. And as always, I shall see you in the next video.